Collision Theory of Chemical Reactions Collision theories explain the rate of reaction in a much better way which was given by Max Trotz and William Lewis in the year 1916 to 18. It is based upon the kinetics theory of gases. According to this theory, it is assumed that the reactant molecule is a hard sphere and reaction between them occurs only when they collide with each other. The collisions in which molecules collide with sufficient kinetic energy, called threshold energy, with proper orientation, so as to facilitate breaking of bonds between reacting species and formation of new bonds to form the products are called as effective collisions. The number of collision that take place per second per unit volume of the reaction mixture is called collision frequency. At normal temperature and pressure, the value of collision frequency is so high around 10 raised to power 25 to 10 raised to power 28. In collision theory, the two important factors are 1. Activation energy 2. Orientation of the molecules together will determine the criteria for an effective collision and hence the rate of a chemical reaction. However, this theory has some drawbacks as well. Like here, we consider atoms and molecules as hard spheres, but it is not so always. 